What is going on, guys? Do you like to touch? Yes, I like to touch too. All right, listen, I'm talking about the F6 laptop. It's a touch screen. It's got a couple tricks up its sleeve, and I'm excited to show you guys what it's all about in today's video. And by the way, if you're not subscribed already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell icon. I do monthly giveaways, and there's a random winner selected every month, and I'll leave a link down below in the description for the notebook. You guys can see what it is, so don't miss your opportunity. Strike when the iron's hot. All right, thank you guys for joining me once again. So here we are, GearBest has a new laptop out. This is the Telcast F6 Pro. Very sharp looking, and one of the features that I like the most is that it has this completely flexible back. So you can use it as a tablet if you wanted to, you could use it as a laptop, you could use it as a stand-up screen, put Netflix, YouTube videos on it. It's got a lot of really cool features, but let's go ahead and start out by seeing what comes in the box. So basically, the only thing that you do get in the box is the computer itself and also a charging cable. Seeing that this computer is touchscreen, one of the things that it can be used as is a drawing pad, which is really nice. If you were to buy a stylus or a pen separately, you can use this as like a workstation if you wanted to draw, if you're a graphics designer. So it has a 13.3 inch full high definition display. It's 1080p. And although it's thin, it's not really bendable, so you don't have to worry about breaking it. It feels very durable. It comes with Windows 10 pre-installed on it, and I have to admit the first thing that I noticed when I turned this computer on was the fact that it asked me what language I wanted to use. That is a big plus when it comes to computers, especially if you're ordering computers from GearBest. It has an Intel dual core one gigahertz processor. It has Intel HD graphics 615. Now I'll admit, this can actually run some lower end graphics games such as Minecraft and other games of that nature. However, don't expect to play Call of Duty or anything really graphic intense on this because I guarantee you, you will not be able to run it. But I did run Minecraft and it ran super smooth. You can see right here, there was no lagging whatsoever. If you're into Minecraft and stuff like that, you can get a good gaming experience with this computer. It has eight gigabytes of DDR3 RAM, so you can do a lot of multitasking on it and you don't have to worry about it lagging or freezing up. It also has 128 gigabytes of SSD storage, which is very nice because SSD is always much faster than a regular hard drive and that's gonna allow you to boot up quicker, open up applications faster, and that definitely speeds the process up so when you're using this computer, you feel like it's a very fast, smooth transition. There is a camera on the front facing side of the screen. It has two megapixels and that'll allow you to capture photos or even do Skype chats with friends. So that's cool, you got the camera included. A couple cool features about this is it does have the fingerprint recognition so you can actually scan your fingerprint when you're booting into this. And the fact that you could bend the screen all the way around, you could prop it up, you can watch YouTube videos like this. Not only can it stand up like this on its own, but it can flip all the way around and you could use this as a standalone tablet. So if you were in need of a tablet, this can be your tablet. If you're in need of a laptop, this can be your laptop. This thing has a lot of really great features in it and I was pleased using it. It takes about three to four hours to charge using the charging cable that was included in the box. And I would say I got about seven to eight hours of usage in it. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the battery lasts pretty long for such a small skinny device. It has a Type-C USB slot, you have a micro HDMI slot, and you also have a USB on this side, and on the other side you have a few other jacks. You have a headphone jack, a charging port, a USB port, a TF card slot, and your power button. The keyboard does feel a little bit condensed, so if you're used to typing on a regular PC or, you know, a full-size keyboard, it's a little bit smaller, so it takes some getting used to, but it's not that big of a deal once you get used to it. It's pretty smooth sailing. Touch, you gotta love the touch. The touch is where it's at. It's all about the touch. Netflix, you want something to stream on. You want a tablet, you could flip it into a tablet. This can be recommended for a lot of different people. I would not recommend this for like a hardcore gamer or a video editor or somebody that needs to do some really, really heavy graphics intense type of stuff on a computer because this right here doesn't have the power to run those type of things. But it is a great computer. Maybe you're looking for a new notebook out on the market. I'll leave a link down below in the description and I'll also try to provide you guys with a promotion code. That's what I do. Here, I try to save you guys money when I find cool items. So I'm gonna talk to GearBest, see if they could supply me some kind of code or something. And I'll leave it down below in the comments so that you guys can use that if you were interested. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please hit the thumbs up button down below. It lets me know that I'm doing my job. And also, if you are into saving money, check out MindSeed Deals down below in the description. It's a page full of flash sales and online deals. So if you are trying to save some money, maybe you're looking for speakers, headphones, projectors, whatever the case may be. So until next time, guys, my name's Casey Nolan. Thank you for rocking with me. We always have fun here on the channel. We're back. We're in full effect. 
We're gonna keep the videos coming and we're gonna keep on touching. We're gonna touch some things. That's right, we're gonna touch stuff on the computer. Whatever you decide to touch on your own is your business. But you know, you do what you gotta do. I will catch you guys later. Thank you once again. Until next time, you gotta rotate. Peace.